So the first thing to note is uh, there was a huge stimulus package that was passed. And part of that, um, families are, are, are getting money. And I spoke about this from uh, the other video. Um, one thing to know is the way the money is being dispersed currently. First, it was if you did your taxes 2018 and 2019, and you did it through direct deposit, those were the people that got their money first. So if you did a direct deposit and you still haven't received your check, it would be very important for you to get support uh, in order to try to figure out what's going on. Uh, the IRS, you can call the IRS or you can find someone in the community that you trust to help you make this phone call so you can figure out why you haven't received um, your, your payment yet through direct deposit. If you usually get a check from your, your tax return, that check comes in later. So people are beginning to receive the check, but it's going to take a longer period of time to receive it. Ingine kitengwa kufatia ni kutoka na msaada ambayo inatoka kwenye state. State inatoa msaada kutoka na wale watu wenye ama walipata layoff, ama kazi, um, masaa zao za kazi zimepungua, ama afanyi kazi, jisi alikuwa anafanya kazi. Kwa hiyo kuna hiyo msaada enye watu wanapata kutoka na hali enye tuko nayo. Kwa hiyo ina saidia sana kama mtu umepata layoff ama kama mtu umepunguza masaa ni muhimu sana kwa kuweza kutafuta hiyo msaada ya state na ili iweze kukusaidia na kutokana na hiyo kuna watu wale wengine wenye wako na business za kwao nazo zimekuwa vigumu sana kwa kuweza kupata hela ya kuweza kulipa watu wengine kwa kuweza kujendelesha kwa hiyo state nayo inatoa msaada kutokana na wale watu wenye wanahitaji hiyo msaada. Kwa hiyo state iko hapo kama unahitaji msaada unaweza ukatu ulizia na tutakupatia maelekezo kuhusu hiyo msaada hizi unaweza ukaiapplike na ukaipata. Um, the, there's also another support which is the unemployment office. Part of the unemployment office is if you were let go by your company or you're not working as many as much as many hours that you used to work before, or you're completely not working at all, you can apply for unemployment in order to receive support. And that unemployment is open to people that work for their own company, if you have your own business, or for people that work for other people's company. So it's important to be able to. Uh, to get those resources because um, you, you can get money that's going to support you moving forward. Uh, ingine kitengu wa kufatia ni kutoka na msaada ambayo inatoka kwenye state. State inatoa msaada kutoka na wale watu wenye ama walipata layoff, ama kazi, um, masaa zao za kazi zimepungua, ama afanyi kazi, jisi alikuwa anafanya kazi. Kwa hiyo kuna hiyo msaada, enye watu wanapata kutokana na hali enye tuko nayo kwa hiyo ina saidia sana kama mtu umepata layoff ama kama mtu umepunguza masaa ni muhimu sana kwa kuweza kutafuta hiyo msaada ya state na ili iweze kukusaidia na kutokana na hiyo kuna watu wale wengine wenye wako na business za kwao nazo zimekuwa vigumu sana kwa kuweza kupata hela ya kuweza kulipa watu wengine kwa kuweza kujendelesha kwa hiyo state nayo inatoa msaada kutokana na wale watu wenye wanahitaji hiyo msaada kwa hiyo state iko hapo kama unahitaji msaada unaweza ukatu ulizia na tutakupatia maelekezo kuhusu hiyo msaada hizi unaweza ukaiapplike na ukaipata the, the thing that you need to know is you have to be patient when you're applying for this support um, because a lot of people are applying for this but it's important to not give up because once you qualify you're going to be able to get you know consistent money that's going to help you pay for your bills and support your family so um, if you have you know interpreting issues you can you can reach out to 211 you know you can reach out to us through uh, the, you know I'll provide my email and 
contact information. I can connect you with the right people that can help you. But it's very important to not give up because this is the biggest resource right now for you, especially if you don't have a job. Um, you know, it's going to take a lot of patience to fill out the documentations, um, but it's important to get the resources that you need to do this. Uh, kitu muhimu sana kuhusiana na hii vitu ya kuapplicate jo unemployment ni mtu kuwa na sobra. Patience ni kitu ya maana sana jo haikuwepe iki kwa sasa ni watu wengi sana hawana kazi kwa hiyo watu wengi sana wana applicate. Inaweza kachukua muda lakini wewe kuwa na sobra tu baadaye itakuja. Na kitu ya muhimu sana ni wewe kwa kuwa naweza kujaza kila weekend. Kila weekend inabidi unajitahidi sana kuwa na jaza ili kwa kuenda uh, kwa kuweza kupata hiyo misaada.